Alrighty. Well, hello out there. I hope there's someone out there. This is the first stream at my new stream time, 5 p.m. PST. So, I'm going to be playing Murdered Soul Suspect. And I have never played this game before, so this should be interesting. Alright. So I already went and did all the settings. Hopefully I got them good. But yeah, let's let's see what this is all about, shall we? Salem, Massachusetts, present day. Hmm. A serial killer is terrorizing the normally sleepy this streets of Salem. This of a bell has been left at the scene of several murders Leading over the past few weeks. To refer to the murderer as the Bell Killer. We spoke with a public relations officer. Authorities are asking anyone with any leads to contact this the SPD's anonymous tip line. The police have yet to attach no any meaning or significance to it. has become synonymous and with no the hysteria surrounding this murder. You're saying there are no leads? No leads at all? Well, you grow up on the streets. You start thinking you're invincible. Nothing can touch you. You never really lose. Go to arrest some freak? Find out you aren't as invincible as you thought. Oof. What kind of name is Ronan? Hey, Brittany. Time to make it official. Ah, it hurts! You steal my car? You paid a price. Oh. How's it going, going, Brittany? You're under arrest for the assault and battery, Vincent Coulter. Guilty on two counts of grand theft auto. On the indictment of burglary. Grand larceny and assault with a deadly weapon. Let me take it. <laughs> I can't have my sister marrying some bum, right? They do. Oh, yeah, I do. No. No, Julian. Stay with me, you hear me? Julia. Oh no, she's dead. No, stay with me. Stay with me. Your family wore felonies like badges of honor. Now you think this new badge covers all that up? You're a fucking criminal. You need to slow down, man. All right? This is crazy. I didn't know better. So you actually want to die. You're under arrest. <sighs> really, it's going, you guess? <laughs> yeah, it goes. How the hell did I survive that? <clears throat> Stay where you are, dirtbag. I'm coming back up. You have the right to remain silent. Any cop you throw out of a window will hunt you down. Kick you. Ooh. Oh, yeah, I'm not doing so hot. Ah. Ooh. Also, I didn't think you could become a cop if you were a felon. Damn it. Knob ain't even moving, it's stuck. Oh, watch it, lady. No, uh, what? No, 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 no. Yeah, I don't think I survived the fall. I can 
fix it. I just get back in my body, and then maybe, maybe I'll, I'll, I'll wake up. Yeah, Britain, he's a ghost. Oh. All right. There's one leg. Now my hand. Glass yeah, the killer. No. Come on. Shit. Uh. Oh, uh. yeah. Oh, ow. Say he's good and dead. Oh, true ghost mode. Head towards the light. No. Oh, okay. There's people on the side, though. Is that his wife? Oh, that's bright. Oh, God, that's bright. I mean, it is the light, so it makes sense. Ronan? I can't believe it. I can't believe I found you. Oh, my God. Julia. Never see you again. You look good. <laughs> I look better. God, I've missed you. I would give anything to be there with you. For us to be together again. But but what? No. Oh no, no, not again. Not you. If you're not here, where are you? It's the other side of the bridge. Hey, what, Rabbit Saucer. What bridge? Where you are is a prison. Or a bridge. It all depends on how you see it. Either way, where you are isn't safe. Do you hear me? We need to get you across the bridge. We need to move on. Move on? Is that where you are? Don't worry about me. Something about your life isn't finished yet. We don't have much time. Think. What about your life feels unresolved? I don't know. To figure that out. Now go. No. Julia, you left me once and it destroyed me. Please, please don't leave me again. We'll see each other again, love. Just save yourself. No, no, no Julia! Don't leave me, Julia! Damn it! So... There's a man in the street outside the Regal Apartments bleeding. He's been shot. Send an ambulance. He's not breathing. My friend says he's not breathing. I can't feel a pulse. There's broken glass everywhere and, and a lot of oh, blood. Man. This is bad. Yeah, I'll stay on the line until help arrives. So... Hey, man. Can you hear me? I don't think so. Lady, please. No. Damn it. Rabbit, how is everyone? Well, I'm doing pretty good. Thanks, Rabbit. What the? Hey, you. 
Hey, can you hear me? Come back. Is that a little girl from the witch trials? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mass sensitivity is a little touchy. I've never seen a dead person before. Yeah, that's not gross. Alright, so okay, I gotta adjust the mouse sensitivity. It's gonna drive me insane if I don't. Mouse sensitivity, we'll put on low. Is there anything else we can do? Oh, that's better. I don't think so. So in order to go to move on to the afterlife and hopefully be with my wife again. Stockades. Um I have to solve my own murder? Interesting. Oh, I just walk. Yeah, I'm a ghost. Of course, I just walk through walls. It's like go oh, I can't walk through ghost things, though. What the? Hey! Little girl, where are you going? You talk to me! <sighs> nice try, kid. Oh! Hey, why did you run? It gets old, giving counsel to the new ones. Don't take it personal. Running through walls, making things appear. You, you look like you've been here a while. You must know how this place works then. <laughs> works? This place isn't hard to understand. Figure out your gifts and maybe you won't get trapped here. Uh, let's see a time limit. Saucer. Just got back from seeing your grandpa at the cemetery and from trip to Walmart. Oh, saucer. I hope it was I thought not you horrible. had some questions for me. Uh Who are you? Looks like you've been here a while. Me? I'm just someone like you. But hear me when I say this is no playground. You can rob yourself of your future, or others can do it for you. I'm sorry, I, I don't understand what you're talking about. How could I rob my own future? You're here to resolve something. You don't resolve it, you don't leave. Don't worry, that's pretty common. Common? That's crazy. Uh, four. What do you mean others can steal my future? Demons. They were once like us, but lost themselves. Oh. They can never move on now, and exist only to consume those lingering here. Those like us. I getcha. Demon threat. Oh, I have information. What's this? Oh. Clues. All clues discovered during investigations are logged here. Check back frequently to recall information about clues in the investigation where you found them. Okay. If I'm not careful, a demon can consume me. Oh, that's not good. Oh. So demon threat and trapped here. Oh my. If I don't resolve what I left undone, I could be trapped here forever. Mm -hmm. Side cases, collected artifacts can be reviewed here. Hey, Krab, how's it going? Uh, as you explore Salem, return here to study your collection. Ooh, side missions. Pass through. As a ghost can pass through real world objects. Nice. Ghosts have the ability to possess living beings. The peak, eavesdrop, and influence abilities become available to you while possessing a living being. Oh. Investigative skill. Your skill at investigations will be ranked based on the number of badges awarded to you. The more badges you acquire, the more proficient a detective you are. Ooh. Uh, Saucer. Uh, he passed away 20 years ago. We said Happy Father's Day to him and others we know who aren't around him anymore. The anniversary of his passing is coming up next month. Oh, okay, Saucer. Well, that's nice. All right. Well. Uh, Don't be shy. What do you mean, gifts? Your strengths in life are stronger in death. They become powers here. Some powers unique. Some common. Possession, influencing people, manipulating the more fragile of ghostly objects to appear or disappear. 
Strengths become abilities. Huh. Okay. The door just hit me, but I'm passing through other stuff. What is it with this place? I thought I'd be able to walk through everything. We can't enter the buildings the people of Salem have consecrated. Save through an opening. Ooh. An open drawer, or a window. But once inside, walls and doors hold no power over us. You'll know the ghostly objects we can't pass through by their blue glow. It will all seem logical in due time. Okay. Ghost abilities. My skills in life become abilities in death. Some are common, some are unique. Fancy. So, I need to figure out who killed me and stop him. That's the way I can get out of here. Well, best of luck to you. Wait, 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 wait. there's more I need to know. Oh, what the? Oh, shit. Demon? Be careful out there. You never know what's waiting around the corner. Thanks, kid. Unfinished business. The guy who gunned me down in cold blood, is he my unfinished business? Maybe. Follow the ghost girl, complete. Return to the semen of the murder. Right, let's go back to the murder. Quick, what's over here? Wait, what? It's a teddy bear in a bucket? Hmm. Okay. Maybe we can look at that later. Alright. Let's go back to my corpse. Which just sounds weird to say but you know mm -hmm. town enter oh, it's the first day of May seeing your own body lying on the street it's like looking in a mirror you don't want to see but can't turn away from. And that's when you realize you no longer know which one's real and which is the reflection. They didn't put a sheet over me yet? Come on, guys. Oh, that's unsettling. Great idea, Baxter. Tamper with the evidence. Backup. Who needs backup? <laughs> you shouldn't have tried to be one of us. <laughs> Man, you were one dumb son of a bitch. Oh, great. <clears throat> Sir? Oh, thank you. Hey, 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 Baxter, hey! Hey, just get back to taking them statements. Come on. Yeah, I'm the stupid one. <laughs> but this is not your scene, Lieutenant. Just pay your specs and move on, please. Yeah, maybe it's not my scene, but it is my case. Tomorrow it'll be my case, and the next day. Until we catch him. You do well to remember that, Sergeant. Look, I'm just following Captain's orders here. You know the procedure when a family member is. Yeah, well. Take all the time you need, I'll take. Oh. I lost count of the times I wished you were dead. Ooh. Do me a favor, con man. Tell Julie I miss her. 
She knows, Rex. She knows. I need to find my killer's trail before it goes cold. Yeah. Saucer, the anniversary is coming up of a friend who passed recently. Oh, that's too bad, Saucer. But on a happier note, your pup's birthday's in a few days. Yay for puppy birthdays. Find the killer's trail. I need to investigate everything I can here to see if I can learn anything new. I need to get my eyes on Stuart's notepad. See what they've learned. So did you did you see the man in the hood? Yes. No, I saw him. He killed that man in the street. Oh, I see. Look at all these people. It'd be nice to know what they're talking about. I gotta see if they found any leads that I don't already know about. Solve investigation. To solve an investigation, you must first search for clues by inspecting suspicious objects and interacting with relevant people by using the possess ability. Ooh. Clues here have gotta tell me something. Okay. Overkill. Yeah. My death. Beaten, thrown from a window, and shot to death. Whoever my killer is sure wanted me dead. Right? Alright. Let's see. Possess. Let's see. Peek. Peeking through the eyes of the living allows you to further your investigation by selecting the most relevant information you find. Ah. So I haven't found any other weapons on the scene. He killed me with my own gun. He didn't have a weapon of his own. What's the most relevant information? Missing tenants. Must be who lived in the apartment I was thrown from. What's the most information? Okay. Standard procedure to notify the tenant when the preliminary forensics report arrives, even if he's supposed to distance himself from the case. Well, I'm going to go with this. Now I need more information about my murder. Oh this? Aha! Alright, the killer used my own weapon to kill me. Why didn't he bring his own weapons? Ooh, good question. How's that supposed to get three badges on that? Oh. Depossess. Oh, nice. Inspect my gun. My backup gun. A backup gun. A lot of good that did me. Right? What's this? Oh. Your last cigarette. Now, last real cigarette. Good. I can finally say I quit. Sort of. Still gonna... Crap, I should have possessed the gun and shoot everyone. <laughs> Turn into the gun from Borderlands. Just run around. Alright, let's possess this guy. Read his mind? Just stay calm. People need the cops to be calm now. Oh. Yeah, stay calm, Mr. Cop on the uh, front lines. Jeez, Ronan. I can't even turn around to look. Oh. I don't well, uh, Okay. Glad I'm not a cop. How are we supposed to stay calm when they can't even protect their own? Ooh. All right. Hey, night paper. I mean, paper, if you want to watch The Walking Dead instead, by all means, go watch The Walking Dead. I'm not going to stop you. Killed by my own bullets. Nah. The killer fired multiple shots into me brazenly in public. Yeah, he didn't seem to care too much. In pieces. Ooh. Shattered glass from the window. I was thrown through. Ooh. Also, paper. What do you mean, watch The Walking Dead? Isn't The Walking Dead on hiatus still? Or one of them come back? I lost track of all that stuff. What's this guy think? Looks like the boys are doing everything we can do. This whole thing is just weird. All of us cops just getting nowhere. Yeah, he sounds confident. Alright, so I possessed him. Let's possess this guy. Oh, you're on episode four paper. You okay? I don't even well, if you're watching it. Here thinking about this, I if you're just 
going back and rewatching it or watching it or whatever. Lady, it'll be there. You, you just stop talking. I oh, and is that blood? I can't even imagine. What about Okay. Be patient with her. She's upset. She's not used to dealing with scenes like this. What would you like to make her tell who she really saw? <gasps> oh. Beaten, throw her window and shot to death. Whoever my killer is, he sure wanted me dead. I don't have the right clues to answer this yet. Okay. Let's keep going then. What a night, huh, Robinson? called in saying he saw the bell killer in their building. Ronan responds, disregards orders for backup. Next thing you know, the bell killer tried to see if he could make him sprout angel wings. And then bam, 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 bam. You really Seven to the chest, you really point have, blank. You really have no idea when to quit, do you, Baxter? <laughs> Ever take a look at those tattoos of his? All that gangland prison crap? He was more criminal than cop. Yeah, you live like a thief, you die like a Wow. He was still a badge, dickhead. Yeah. Still a cop, jerk. I came here because a witness called in a report of possible sighting of the Bell Killer at this location. Okay. Seems a little shady. But okay. Influence. Your ability to correctly influence a person is dependent on the clues you find in the investigations. Ah. Paper, you're also working. Oh, I see paper. The killer wouldn't come back to the scene, would he? Glad I wasn't here when it was happening. Can I take pictures with my phone? Is that legal? Wow, lady. God. Can I take pictures? Oh, let me take a selfie. <sighs> Alright, let's see if we can get this woman now that I have more clues. Paper and your grandmother died on Friday. Wow. I'm sorry, Paper. That sucks. Let's see. Influence. Bell killer. Name here because of what is called in the report puzzle setting the bell killer at this location. Select. Yeah. Yeah, I saw it. That man in the hood. Outside. Uh, looking up at, at the top apartment on the fourth floor, I think. Killers are A witness thinks the killer was headed up to the top floor apartment intentionally. It wasn't random. Ah. Okay. Well, I got all the clues, it looks like. So I can conclude my investigation. The killer came here for a reason. But what was it? Well, he went upstairs. Fortunately, I need someone to let me in. The apartment up there must have some clues. So that's my way in, and it's closed. Fantastic. Cops going in. Well, here's my chance. I just need to fall Stewart into the building. All right. The cops' findings aren't leading to my killer's trail yet. I should check the top floor apartment. Aha. Uh -huh. Also, why did I only get three, two badges on here? How did I? Okay, whatever. Not gonna worry too much about that. There's a ghost. Hey, ghost. Hey, excuse me. Do I need to wait for someone to open a door every time I want to go inside? Yeah, any buildings that were consecrated can be a bit tricky getting into, but once you're inside, it's smooth sailing. Same goes for getting out. Open doors, windows, whatever. It's all fair game. How many buildings are like this? Around here, pretty much all of them. 
Don't worry, you'll get the hang of it. All right. Paper, you get off at 10, you be here after that. All right, Paper. Well, I hope you have a quick and easy rest of your time at work, and see you later. Let's go to the apartments. Oh, that's why people get the shivers randomly when it's not actually cold out. 10 What is that? Oh, hey. Oh, uh, yeah, Brittany, I think this might be a spoopy game. I'm not a fan of whatever oh, that was. It's just you. I knew I heard something. Yeah, sorry about that. There was something behind me, though. You should probably watch out for it. Wait, can I go in this room? Okay, I'm in a closet now. Paper, question. Are you going to get on Rome later? Uh, probably not tonight, Paper, no. But I, don't, I haven't made any plans for what I'm doing after stream yet either, so... Hey, buddy. What's up? Hey, uh... <laughs> Shit. You trying to give me another heart attack? No, I, I just... It was rhetorical, for God's sake. Come yeah. on, don't look so lost. Take a look around or something. You know, spy a little. It's not like anyone's gonna stop you. Eh. Wow. Alright. Thanks for no help. So I'm assuming these marks are where the ghosts walk through the walls most of the time. Which, considering this is someone's bedroom, that's just a little freaking creepy. I'm sure you saw the whole thing, and that makes you special. Always looking out the window, sticking your nose in everyone else's business. I did see it. And I'm going to have nightmares. I think we've got enough nightmares to last us a while. Don't talk about that. Don't ever talk about that. I'm happy to stop talking. I'm trying to watch a show, you know. Talk about what? What's going on here? You get a better view of the street on TV. Staring out the window. What good's that gonna do? Look at that poor excuse for a man. Won't even get out of his chair. Likes a chair more than me. Maybe if I stopped bringing him snacks, he might look around the room to see if I was still here. Oh. Look at that poor okay. excuse for a man. Won't even get out of his chair. Likes a chair more than me. Hey. Okay. Let's see. I imagine there's nothing else to pay attention to here. I also imagine that the... Wait, what's this? Ghost items? What the hell? Is that a busted up shovel? A broken something and a something? Whatever. Oh, I was gonna say, I think these markings are also here to help me know where I can go in and out of places. Oh, okay. Interesting. Honey, they can probably hear you talking through the ceiling. I hope they do. Every time we visit Jennifer at this place, it's the same weird characters. That other lady on the second floor, she changes boyfriends like she changes sweaters. And my goodness, the racket. Okay. I know that upsets you, dear. Gus needs some friends. Someone else who can listen to him hammer. Uh-oh. Hope he doesn't ask any questions. He'll know I've tuned him out. <laughs> I need you. Can't wait for Jennifer to move out of this dump. My granddaughter needs a yard. Where does she play? The street? Granddaughter? How old are you two? Wait for Jennifer to move out of this dump. All right. Oh, what's through here? Oh, hello. It's a workshop. What the? Hmm. 
Ooh, case files. There are many types of objects to discover in Salem. Pay attention to your surroundings as you explore. Even the simplest paper can reveal secrets about Salem. Ooh. You need six more to uncover the story. Oh. So that was the old... I was going to say it was a boiler at first, but I think it might be... A... It's either a boiler or a furnace. Oh, hey. can just find it, then at least I'll know what happened. I've looked everywhere. Why did they do this to me? What if I never find it? If I only knew who it was, maybe I'd know where to look. Hello? Lost. What's lost is my body. I know I got killed right here. And I know it sounds crazy, but but I'd feel a lot better if if I knew where my body was. Are you a detective or something? You might be my only hope. <gasps> yeah, I'm a detective. Any idea who did it? That might lead us to your body. I know they were old people. Uh-oh. And I know they lived in this apartment building. Other than that, everything is hazy. But I was doing a lot of drugs at the time. Oh. Sounds like you do need a detective. I'll see what I can find out from any older residents of the building. Oh, I already think I know who this is. The mysterious murder. She thinks an older couple in the building murdered her. I should try and find some information from any of the old residents. The old couple that was over here that just said shut up about don't talk about it. I think that's a pretty good clue. So why are ghosts going through this wall? Oh. Hey, look, it's another fragment. Oh, furnace. Right, there's another fragment of the mystery. That's probably... Yeah, that's an outer wall, so we can't go through the outer wall. Right, let's go back and investigate the uh, old cranky couple. What's this? Can I... Can I interact with this? I don't know what that is. It's weird. Alright. What do they know about the murder of the girl in the laundry room? What was this? A note. Uh, the na their neighbor left in town in a hurry. Maybe they had something to do with it? Gardening tools and potting soil. Shovels, glove, fertilizers. Hobby, hobby or homicide? Ooh. So the old couple in the corner apartment. Oh, what's in here? I thought I saw something in the shower just now. Hmm. Yeah, look. Why? What? I don't know. You got a better view of the street on TV. Let's see. No. All right. Let's continue collecting some clues. Is this guy still in here? What's he doing? What are you still doing here? Have a little fun. Okay. What was through here? The entrance. So what's through? Wait. Oh, the entryway. Interesting. Am I seeing anything here? It's not the old couple. Maybe if I stopped bringing him snacks. 
vaccines. Might look around the room to see if I was still here. Looks like the old man had something to do with the girl's murder. But why drive all the way to Side Smithwick Quarry? Hmm. Let's see if I can trigger influence. No. like paper when Grace hit her. <gasps> I still can't believe she died. It happened so fast. I've never seen Grace so crazy before. It must have been the lack of sleep. Thank God it's all over. I can finally watch TV in peace. Whoa. Apparently his wife has a bit of a temper. She murdered that girl. Where's the body? The quarry? I'm going to say the quarry. Let's see, are there any other secrets? That's an outer wall. The bathroom. Hmm. Conclude investigation. While well, you can attempt to answer your primary question at any time through exploration of the entire scene is often necessary. See, I had three badges are my three attempts. Okay, we have one more clue. Let's see if we can find this last clue. Aha! Newspaper. Breaking at the quarry? Kids are always breaking into the quarry. Why take such an interest in this one? Staring out the window. What good is that going to do? I can't, I can't influence him. What if I do this? No, I can't influence her either. Okay. Secret and the tools? No, then it's gonna be the note. Ha. Huh. Looks like Grace couldn't take the girls' partying anymore. So she killed her and roped her husband into helping dump the body at Smithwick Quarry. I should get back and let her know. Wow. Oh, now I get how this works. So the badges are my attempts, I'm assuming. The girl was murdered by a couple who lived in the apartment. One aged because her loud parties. They dumped her body in the quarry. Okay. Let's go talk to her then. Let her know we figured it out. What's this? Info about my killer, one of 39. One of 39? 
Though the city of Salem has seen its rate of violent deaths increase sharply in the past few months, the Salem Police Department is unwilling to state officially that the deaths are connected. It's been a rough couple of months, said SPD spokesperson Ingrid Larson, but it would be irresponsible to jump to conclusions about any of these deaths, much less a connection between them. We are investigating each of these thoroughly and making judgments based purely on the evidence. Brittany, why would they keep that clipping, though? I don't think they kept the clipping on the table. I think that that was because it was in ghost view. I think it was supposed to be like the after, like an after image of it. So I was able to see it. I think that's how all the, because like the gardening supplies aren't still in the um, closet by the front door, even though the little ghostly outlines of them are still there. So I think it's supposed to be like, echoes of the past like the items that are connected to this traumatic event leave behind little echoes is kind of how i'm interpreting it right now unless the game contradicts me later so i think that's why like the newspaper clipping was on the table why the note from the neighbor was on the side table by the door why we could see the outline of the gardening tools that's what i think is happening all right ma'am you're in the quarry turns out the reason you can't find your body is because it's not in the building. It's at Smithwood Quarry, about five miles out of town. Oh. Well, why'd they do it? The parties were keeping them awake at night. They finally got too tired and snapped. I, I thought they were just being unreasonable. I didn't know they would do this. <sighs> Thanks for your help. You have no idea how big a relief it is just knowing. No problem. You know, I never really liked cops. And they were always giving me shit, telling me how I was messing up my life. We never saw eye to eye on things. But you really came through for me. Probably should have listened to what they were trying to tell me. Maybe then things wouldn't have ended up like this. Thanks again. <gasps> Ooh, look. She resolved her issue and went to... We're going to say heaven, just, you know. The missing body. Ooh. All right. What else? I was collecting fragments of things. The pool room. Oh, my, we're back in the entrance hall again. I see. The laundry. That's an outer door, so we can't go through it. Anything in the pool room to collect? And someone was in here recently. It's a lit cigarette still burning in the ashtray. Alright, let's go... Upstairs. Because I'm pretty sure we've done all of the downstairs. This says exit. Does that mean it's an actual exit? Oh yeah, it goes out into the front lobby, gotcha. Okay, and I still want to know what this is. There's another one. Oh, I wonder if these are the breadcrumbs I'm supposed to follow. Also, why do I keep seeing ghosts disappearing? That's freaky. I am a ghost that freaks me out even. Four more to uncover the horrible truth of the watery grave. another thing. There's another thing. I'm gonna go with breadcrumbs. Oh. What the? No. Oh. Hey, kid. What are you doing? Come back. Did I do that? Hey, hey, come back. Those notes aren't for you. Great. Looks like some sort of code or something. Hmm. Uh, well, I made it up to the fourth floor before the police cart away the evidence. There's a much deeper mystery here involving these, I'm sure. If 
for now, let's just see who's in 2B. Half off the heat, lady. You're gonna burn your dinner. Maybe she's getting too much sugar. I mean, that keeps kids awake, right? Just once, I'd like to have a nice phone conversation with an adult without interruption. Maybe she's getting too much sugar. Okay. I mean, that keeps kids awake, right? Interesting. What is this? Is a ghost? Hmm. This intrigues me. What are these? Mommy, mommy! Oh, because of you. Enjoy scaring kids. This little girl cost me everything. It was supposed to be a simple job. Easy money. What do you mean? She's just a kid. It don't matter what she is. Her daddy owed too much to the wrong people. She was just an insurance policy. Is that where you come in? A simple snatch and grab. After everything was settled up, uh, I'd let her go. Wow. I'm guessing it wasn't so simple. That may be. But she owes me now. I ain't leaving till her debt is paid. Cut your losses. It may be a while. Don't worry. I can wait. I've got nothing but time, my friend. Okay. Dick bag. What's over here? Wow, what's through here? Ah, hallway. I see. So, what are these? Like, after images or something? Him walking through into the closet, it looks like. Well, supposedly there's a little girl hiding under there, but I don't see anything through the little gap. Creep. Well, I don't think I can do anything to help here, unfortunately. Let me see if I can... Just once, I'd like to have a nice phone nope. conversation with an adult without interruption. Well... I'd like to say that I can do something to help, but I don't see how I can. Okay, so I've got... Let's see... Here's article one. We read that. Oh, here we go. So, remove, reveal, peek, investigate, possess, and pass through. What was this? A watery grave. Old boiler. It is an old boiler. I've got a couple of them. All right, let's see if we can figure this one out. Didn't see anything in here that could help us. All right, so we're heading this way. Two hmm, A. Well, right, boys, place your bets and hope your luck improves. It ain't about luck, Evergreen. You got that right, buddy. You might want to remember that when you're looking at your sorry track record. Well, there's always some element of chance. Maybe you'll teach us some tricks, huh? Then I couldn't keep taking your lunch money, big guy. All right. Pull up your panties, gentlemen, and throw in some chips, Nate. Good lord, these boys are easy pickings. <gasps> Poor guys. I remember when I still thought poker was a game of chance. <laughs> Oh, okay, we got the camera. Look at those magic cards she has. They all stick together and she just holds on to the middle. Keep cool, big boy. Next hand, you take her down. Do you, though? Do you? A few more good cards would help. 
I never know if she likes me or she's just being nice. I want to let her win, but she's just going to win anyway. Wow. All right. Back off, will ya? Ooh, pizza and donuts. <gasps> Cupcakes. Dang. Water and booze. My kind of party. Oh, can I? I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I interact with the TV. Is that why there's this little orange thing on top of it? Come on, you in or you out? I don't. I guess not. Hmm. Just play your cards already. Oh, what's this? More of the boiler story. What's in here? Crummy bathroom. Oh. There's an old guy sitting in a chair in here. Interesting. And we're back in the hallway. Okay, okay. Uh. Ugh. Oh, you can you piss right off. Oh, shit. Yeah, Brittany, a friend, sure. Demons. If demons find you, they will hunt you down and suck your soul. Escape from demons. The residue of a ghost soul hides your presence from demons. Hide to hide. <laughs> Clever. You can move between hit hide objects to avoid demons. Brittany, pff, Harry Potter already did this. Uh, uh. Escape from demons. If demons can't find you for a while, they will stop checking and leave. Oh, good. Crab lol. Lunatic Chef, hello, how's it going? left. Approaching demons. Hold F to see demons through walls. Remember to always approach demon carefully. What's it doing? I think it's spazzing over there is what it's doing. So am I supposed to do this? Execute the demon. Oh, you must approach the demon from behind. If you want to execute it, holding R will attempt an execution. Oh, hell yeah. Hey, demon. Exorcism. Haha. -ha! <laughs> Brittany touched its butt. I. Uh, that was pretty close to touching its butt. All right. So he exercised a demon. Ah, nice. Three F. Wait, uh, didn't I'm not supposed to be getting onto the fourth floor? Where? 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 Oh, jeez. This floor's crawling with demons. What the heck?
to come all the way down here, demon. No. And this little buddy doesn't seem to care. Cool. Now what's this? Lillian and Lillian. Every time Ronan says Lillian, I don't know if he's talking about his mother or his gun. It complicates things. That the gun was a gift from his mother and then he named it after her. Normal couples don't deal with stuff like this. Mother? You mean wife? I is confused. Okay. Well, I got three hidey spots here if I need them. Good. Let's hit through this wall first. A lot more hidey spots. Huh. Oh, I can poltergeist things with the orange. Weird. Alright. That's one heck of a screensaver. Nothing in the bathroom. Okay. Let's continue. Oh, there's a ghost here. Hey, dude. Hey, it's... It's you. You're famous. Check out the TV. I'm good. Thanks. <gasps> yeah, I, I, I know. Thanks. I already know. Actually. You should watch this. It's wild. Sure, thanks. Ah, another boiler mystery. Ooh, we're gonna find it soon. This is by far the worst birthday party ever. What do you mean? We got brews? We got TV? What more do you want? Uh, I don't know. Party, maybe? Cool. We could drive to Boston. Drive to Boston? Uh... I think you can see me through the wall. An idea. What? Logistically speaking, I don't know. Work that out. You want to take your car? Well, you make a good point. Parking, driving, gas. What? A lot of hassle, bro. Too much. Not to mention the gas prices these days. Yeah, it's out of control. Where's any gas in? Oh, shit. I messed that up. Come on, give it up. No one here. Oh, that was close. Man, I messed that one up, didn't I? Okay, let's try this again. This time we'll get him. Got him. Damn demon. Now I can walk around in peace. Why can't adventures happen without going outside? <laughs> What's the use of a party if you have to plan it? That's like work. Oh, wow. You know, I'd be fine just watching a video. My party doesn't mean that I should do all the work. You know, I'd be fine just watching a video. 
<laughs> All right, you two. Nothing? All right. Nothing in this closet. Ooh, that's weird. Okay. Let's keep going. Oh wait, that's okay, that's where we came up. We wanna keep going this way. Do 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 do. Three A's. Is this the party? Oh no, this is a different place. Doesn't look like anyone's up? Maybe? Man, they sure gave me enough hidey spaces for those demons. Oh, they're in bed, I see. Oh shit! So which was it, electrocution or slit wrists? The razor. It was only supposed to be the razor. That's what the voices told me. The music was just something to focus on until I bled out. <laughs> so the radio was just an accident? I started the cut. Warm water made my skin so soft, but I couldn't go through with it. The radio slipped off the edge when I was getting out. I didn't want to die. It was the voices in my head that wanted me dead. Uh, I'm sorry, kid. Oof. That sucks. Well, sitting here moping about it ain't gonna fix anything. You may as well move on. Man. People really live like this, throwing their shit on the floor all the time. No. This guy's boring. <laughs> I don't know if she's supposed to be asleep or if she's supposed to be laying there awake and ignoring him. I can't do anything with these two. Oh, what's this? When Dad comes. Coffins. When death comes, it'll never be alone. So. Okay. Too are boring. I guess. No, I don't think they heard it. All right, well, let's continue. This place is boring. So, okay, I came from the south stairwell. Okay, here's the party boys. All right, to the last stairwell. Anything here? No. I hope there's not more demons upstairs. Oh. Okay, folks, I need you to keep your distance from the scene. What happened up here? I'm afraid that's still under investigation. I got thrown out of a window. We're still looking at the details. Thrown out of a window? By who? Yeah, who did it? Sorry, like I said, it's under investigation. God, why can't I think of anything original to ask? <gasps> why doesn't this guy answer Jill? She's got good questions. I don't want to be outside alone now. I should make sure I stay with these people when I go. God, why don't they just tell us? What are they afraid of? That we'll be afraid of. Holy! I'm afraid already. Actually, they're not 
sounding so sure now. Oh, oh Can hold I on. stay at your place for a few days? Boop. People, yeah. I understand your concern. I'd appreciate it if you just move along and let us do our work. Well, thank you, Snootek Chef, for the 2500 bits. Some support for the channel. Thank you. I appreciate it quite a bit. And everyone got some cool emotes. Yay! Right. Can I possess the... This isn't a party. This is a murder investigation. Yeah, people. God, no way. Why does everyone need the gory details? Uh, it's human nature. We just got to loosen up. Jeez, just tell them what happened. They'll find out soon enough. Eh, okay. I don't know if I agree with that, but whatever. I want to know more about this. Turned over table, a broken vase, and a turned over wheelchair? What is happening here? Must have been a while ago. A different wallpaper, too. Hmm. Let me give you the chills. There's a couple standing here. One more to go. Hoo -hoo. Here we go. You seen that little girl that lives here? She turns up. You come find me. Got it? Girl that lives here. What? Baxter's looking for a girl. Baxter's asking about one of the missing tenants. Okay. <coughs> ah, my main piece. This is my backup gun down in the street. Can't touch Damn it, remember. My mom gave me that gun. Oh, his mom did give him that gun. What was the killer doing here in the first place? What did I miss? So, what the? <gasps> you can reveal the residue of memories imprinted in this realm. Oh, yeah. Purposeful searching. Came in, went over to the closet. The bell killer was looking for something or someone. What was he searching for? Hmm. It's just an old tarp in here, it looks like. My primary gun. I had two guns and couldn't couldn't take this guy down. Jeez. Right? Let's see here. Oh, here we go. We did it. Collected a series of mystery vestige artifacts. Recall the flashback. I still remember seeing the ad for the Regal Apartments in the paper. It's easy for people to look at it and see a dingy, run-down shithole. But me? I saw a place with history, a character. I saw a place full of artistic inspiration. Before I knew it, I was the official tenant of apartment 3A. Mm. Looking back on it, I wish I had never even unpacked. My new apartment turned out to have more character than I had anticipated. The carpets were occasionally soggy. The pipes were rusty, and I could hear the tenant below me banging against the walls and screaming at the top of his lungs. Oh, great. Sure, there were other problems with the place, but they just added to its charm. They were things I could live with. What I couldn't live with was showering in brown water, Ugh. mysterious leaks molding the carpet, and obnoxious neighbors. I called the plumber, who arrived just as I was about to have a word with the people downstairs. When I showed him the wet spots on the carpet, he scratched his head and explained that nothing was leaking and that the reason for the wet spots was most likely due to me spilling something and not realizing it. Did this guy take me for an idiot? I never spilled a thing. He apologized and said that without a leak, there's nothing he could do. So he moved on to the shower. Thankfully, the water had no trouble turning brown. He thought it could be an issue with a rusty boiler and went to check it out. I took the opportunity to address the tenants below. 
I knocked on the door, but no one answered. In fact, I couldn't hear anything at all. I tried the door, expecting it to be locked, but it just swung open. I was shocked to find it completely empty. That's when wet footprints began to appear on the floor. Uh-oh. They were headed right for me. Just then, I could hear the plumber scream from the boiler room downstairs. By the time I ran down there, he was long gone, but he had discovered the source of the brown water. Packed into the old rusty boiler was a bloated, oh. decomposing corpse. The police are still investigating the homicide, and the landlord has promised to renovate the boiler room. Oh. However, despite his efforts, 3A is back on the market, and I doubt I'll ever feel clean again. Oh, I agree, Brittany. Gross. Oh, showering in the brine of dead body. Oh, my God. Uh, a million showers with the most potent of cleansers would never make me feel clean again if that happened to me. Oh my god, that's gross. Hey, you. Man, we gotta find these tenants. If they're still alive. Man, we gotta find these tenants. Oh. If they're still alive. This guy's just a fountain of info. What's this? Cassandra Foster, please note, this is the K same Cassandra Foster who occasionally worked with the San PD as a psychic consultant. Ah. One of the missing tenants, Cassandra Foster, worked with the police as a psychotic, psychic, not psychotic, consultant. Oh my. I don't know how this will end. The killer is an enigma to the police and a lurking shadow in my own life. If only I can keep Joy from harm, I would do anything, even push her away, if it meant pushing her to safety. Oh. Okay, whoever Joy is. Interesting. What's this? Wow, camera. Hmm, I don't know. Stick. Signs of the struggle. My confusion with the killer led to a vicious fi oh, confrontation, led to a vicious fight. Oh, yeah. Spiritual. Book about ghosts. Book about ghosts in different realms. Ooh. Let's see. What's. In there, oh, what's this? Oh, she was hiding. Let's see, frightened, hiding, watching. Yeah, she isn't very old, is she? Hiding witness. There was a witness to the fight with the killer. What did she see? Is this Joy, I wonder? The one that the psychic was worried about? Well, this is an open window I can escape out of. Alright, let's see. What other clues are here? Wow. Really into some weird occulty type stuff, it would seem. Okay. So we have six out of the 14 available clues. Jeez. Let's go see what's in this room. All right, this is the hallway. Oh, what is that light? Oh, it's literally a light. Ugh. Okay. This is the window I got tossed out of. Shattered, no kidding. The window the killer threw me out of. There's half the clues. Oh. My last fight. Got tossed around pretty bad. This guy's strong. Okay. Let's 
keep searching for damn clues. I like how you just walk through things. It makes life so much easier. I mean, it makes death so much easier, actually, would be a more appropriate way to put it. Why is there... Ghosts come through here often, huh? Okay. The bathroom's not gonna tell me anything. Not seeing anything in the closet. Dream catcher. There's gotta be another clue. Man, we gotta find these tenants. If they're still alive. You're still just as useless as before. Okay, so I found one of six of the worried about joy things. Alright, so nine out of sixteen. So we have one of those, one of those, one of those, one of those, and ten of these. Ooh. Fancy. Okay. So eight out of fourteen clues. I don't... Am I missing something? Stand at the counter, do nothing the whole time, dude. That's great. So I got two more locked things over here. Closet. And the girl. Turn around. You're under arrest. Was there when this happened? Oh. Damn. Oh. Oh. Wow. He is strong. That handed me across the room. Solve investigation. Some investigations include multiple questions requiring multiple answers. Ah. That girl might be who the killer was after. We need to find out. Now, let's go take a look out this way, shall we? I need to finish investigating before I go somewhere else. We're not done investigating? What more is there to investigate? Where's that picture she was looking at? Hmm. Let's think a second. Okay. Let's see. I'm not quite sure how there's more clues here. Not seeing anything. I 
not sure how. I guess let you free look around a bit. What was in here again? Right, the hallway. Oh, hello. This whole room I haven't even gone in yet. <clears throat> it's usually the engaged people who are nervous about meeting the parents of their intended. But I was looking forward to it, and Ronan's parents were nervous, stumbling all over themselves to make a good impression. Ronan's dad was all thumbs and really quiet, like he was representing his own crude nature. He was sweet, though, and Lillian was a rough gem. Such a good heart. I hope they understand how much I adore him. I get it. These are from the perspective of his wife. Okay, this is that tainted spot with the wheelchair. Weird. All right. Hmm. Let's see. Ooh, what do we have here? Kid psychological drawings? Does the tenant work with children? These appear to be psychological sketches. Ah. Four more clues, gang. Packed bag? Packing or unpacking? If someone was packing to leave, why'd they leave this behind? Maybe they just arrived. It's got the passport in it and everything. Hmm. Just a few more clues. Okay, I'm not. Base, some garbage bags, a drop cloth. Interesting. Brittany, you're going to hop off real quick and go on mobile? Early day tomorrow. All right, Brittany, no worries. Oh. Oh, wait. Look here. There's a photo missing. It's not a clue, though, really? game? It's not. I'd say it is. <coughs> hmm. Maybe... something
All right. Sorry about the couple little pauses here. I had something. I had to blow my nose, but I also had a little yuck in my throat. And it finally decided to let loose. Oh, hello, stupid me. Obscured photos. That looks like the witness, but what else support these pictures? Okay, ding dong. Let's uh, get you out of my way. Why don't you... Go check out... These? No. Oh, I need to make him pick up the folder. Of course. <clears throat> that would be... This. No? Really? Crap. What would make him pick up the folder? Missing persons request? Nope. Uh... I see. I had a three badge ranking, and now that I've used too many of the oopsies, you're wrongs. Possible. No, that doesn't make sense. None of these really make sense, though. Of course, look at the photos. Do we? Should get this photo to Rex for that Amber Alert. Man, we gotta find these tenants. Oh, okay. Hmm, photos of the witness collected as evidence. I can find info of... Can I find info of where she went in... Went in them. Ah, gotcha, gotcha. If they're still alive. Alright, there's no peak option. Oh, he moved. Focus. <clears throat> Touch. You can receive psychic flashes from certain objects by... Pinpointing sounds denoted, denoting the strongest psychic energy. Oh. <clears throat> photo of a young girl taken by herself in this apartment. Okay. A photo of a young girl and an older woman, most likely a relative. A photo of a young girl and a priest in front of a local church. Father, do you have anywhere that I could stay just for a little oh, bit? Oh, of course, dear. The church is always your deal. Nah, that didn't sound creepy at all, the way he said that. The witness is staying in a nearby church. Yeah. Did it. At least I got him to move. Include the investigation. Gun me down on the street and you didn't even check for witnesses? Like you're untouchable. That girl is my only lead. I need to find her. Find the killer's trail completed. Aha! We did it! Alright, let's... I need to find the girl, the witness, to see what she knows. I think we're done in here then. Whoops. Oops. Exit the apartment. All right, we knew that. Where's the church? What are those strange markings? Could drop down. I know it won't kill me, but I still hate heights. <laughs> oh look, I I levitated down. That was pretty cool. Find the witness. The witness is my only lead. I need to find her. That church is my best bet. Okay. Oh hey, what's this? 
Give you my life. Everything died for me. The end of forever. Thinking about it is so surreal. I instantly have an out-of-body experience every time, seeing myself in that moment. After she tried to break up an argument between two men on the street, two strangers to her, one of which would stab her for no reason at all. She died for trying to help, and the asshole got away. If I'd arrived to meet her just one minute earlier, my life would have been be different, better, and she wouldn't have been gone. Oh, that sucks. Alright. What's this? Harassed by Baxter. Rough day at work for my mom. For my man. It took a while for him to be able to talk about it, but this Baxter fellow seems to be completely hostile towards Ronan. There's nothing he can do about it. It's a mystery why there's so much animosity. Ronan has never done anything to offend him, but Baxter decided what kind of person Ronan was. And there's no convincing him otherwise. You can't teach some pe You can't teach some people. Oh, that sucks. Face it, Baxter hated the guy. <clears throat> I think the hate was pretty mutual. Ronan was a little rough around the edges. But Baxter, he isn't exactly Mr. Cuddly. Yeah, but you don't think he'd... I mean, a fellow cop. Or anybody. In this job, I'm surprised less every day about what people are really capable of. <clears throat> Baxter and Ronan's mutual animosity. Cops wonder if Baxter hated Ronan enough to kill him. Well, certainly seems there's a lot of animosity there. All right, and then some old shack in the middle of the road as a marker for you can't go this way. Okay, I can't get into this building either. There's another shack in the way. Yeah, who cares about a fit? What the? Oh, it's a boat. I was like, what is that? Come join us. Okay, I'm on my way. I really want to know what these after images of people are about. Like that one. Oh, Lunatic Chef, you're going. Good night, everyone. See you soon. All right, Lunatic, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks again for those bits. Hope to see you again. Oh. Oh. Okay. Where does this go? Oh. Is there a reason for this? No, not as of yet, at least. I wish ghosts were real and we could just talk to them. Huh? I'd accuse my boss of witchcraft in a heartbeat. Oh, wow. I wish ghosts were okay. real and we could just talk to them. Crab, this game sucks, Ryan, when he saw what you were playing. Well, maybe Ryan sucks. Who knows? Some people just don't have time for a cool murder mystery and they want to go play shoot 'em up bang bang. I get it. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna have to use those eventually. Wait, what? oh, the high I gotcha. Like, why am I seeing a trigger? Hello? <laughs> Listen, I don't know if there's anything I can do, but it looks like you could use some help. I, I, I don't know how I got here, or, or even where here is. I can't remember what happened to me. Why am I like this? I'm, I'm sorry to tell you, kid. But if you're here, it means you're dead. I knew it. <laughs> <clears throat> Look, I'm in a similar situation. Now, I used to be a detective. Let me take a look around and see if I can find anything that will help you make sense of all this. 
I, I don't even know where you'd start. Is there anything you remember? It doesn't matter how small. Sometimes the tiniest detail is all it takes. Um, I remember lots of people in this rowboat. I, everyone was scared. And I, I keep seeing the name Mana Hansen. That's a start. Let me see what I can do. Hmm, she was on a shipwreck. It doesn't look like she remembers much. I wonder what the name Mona Henset refers to. The boat she was on that sunk. This is her obituary. She died when a rowboat capsized and sank. Her body was never recovered. What was she doing on a rowboat? Interesting. This rowboat? <clears throat> Alright. How did the lady on the beach die? Oh, there we go. Now I can get back up. Cool. Survivors of the Mona... Wait, what? Survivors of the Monoset steamer wreck. Yep, see? She was on a boat and it went down. Witness only saw the suspect's face briefly. Much of the face obscured, but the suspect appeared to be white male with blue eyes. Uh. Candles? Hmm. A bunch of candles were left here over the years. Most of them look like prayer candles. Well, how does that help me? Game. Oh, aha! There's a note. <clears throat> you will be deeply missed. You are a hero to us all. Huh. Hero to us all. Looks like more than one person owes her their lives. Interesting. <clears throat> huh. Looks like a memorial of some kind. Bad people. Looks like there's some kind of lemon tree left here. I wonder if it has anything to do with the girl. For more than just this around here, finding that stuff could help piece things together. Well, I got all five clues. So. <clears throat> How did the lady on the beach die? Obituary. She was a hero. She saved a lot of people before her rowboat sank. She needs to know how much she meant to them. Hey, you. Got it. Did you find anything? <clears throat> that name you remember, the Mono Hanset? Turns out it was a steamer ship that sank right outside of Salem Harbor. If it weren't for you, a lot of people would have died. You're a hero. If I saved everyone, then how did I die? No, no, you, you didn't save everyone, but you were trying to. Your rowboat capsized. I can't swim, so I must have drowned. I'm sorry. No, don't be. Thanks to you, instead of fear and sadness, I feel pride. If it weren't for you, I would never have known. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. I'm glad I could help. Oh, now she has her little moment of ascension. Ah, oh, look at us doing good. What is going on up here? Oh, yeah, I can walk through that. Is there something happening here? I can hide. Which makes me think the demon is going to chase me through the streets on the way back. 
Ah, there's something down here. It's just faster. The car tattoo. I didn't even have to ask about the car stealing tattoo. I hate it. It's garish, crude, common. He can sense my disapproval, but I suppose it's too late. All tattoos come with the danger of regret. Oh, hello. Where do you intend to take me, Mr. Ramp? Need 15 more to uncover the story of the Eternal Flame? Holy snapdragons. Okay. Well, we're on the hunt for some gas cans. Hopefully they're not overly hard to find. Not seeing anything there. Or there. Yeah, let's double check. Almost positive there's not gonna be anything over here, but just to make sure. Okay, so. Let's go over here to the other side of this barricade. Check here. Okay, nothing right there. Now, is there anything in this back corner? I saw whatever you were fluttering there for a split second. Just ambient trash. Uh, another hide. That's closed. Another hide. Interesting. <clears throat> Anything on this gazebo? Nope. Nothing to do with the gazebo. Look at all these hiding spots. St. Benedict's Church, historic site. Oh, I see. Pirate history plaque. This spot overlooks the favored launching point of many privateers who operated with tact, tacit permission of the Continental Navy during the Revolutionary War. Salem was the primary harbor for heavily armed and fast-moving ships that would attack Royal Navy ships as they attempted to apply pressure to the neighboring port of Boston Harbor. Oh, okay. This is... Oh, his life. No one made me smile like you did, Jules. Oh. That's where that picture was taken. Day at the beach. The pictures we took at the beach come out surprisingly well, considering it was almost dark. The one I got of Ronan just as the sun was setting was brilliant. It wasn't much for catching Ronan's features, but my, what a silhouette that man cuts. He makes everything around him look good. Salem could use that shot to sell itself as a beach resort. Wow. True love, everyone. You ever try and jump in the water? It'll... Oh, it won't let me walk off the dock. Fair enough. But yeah, we don't want to make any ghost swimming. I want to go to the church. Yeah, you know what? Let's. May has well. I have a feeling we're going to be back on that we beach. Away. We need a sanctuary. A place where nothing bad can touch you. But you can never escape the questions. They follow you everywhere.
I need to figure out where the witness is. Zero of one clue. Uh, it's not going to let me get up the stairs, I see. Where do I touch it? Oh! 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 I get pulled down to hell. Yeah, that makes complete sense. Saw. The Bell Tower Banshee. Oh, boy. Here we go. There's a hidey spot. There's another hidey spot. Some part of the old original building, it looks like. Also, is there a demon in here? Okay, not on patrol yet, at least. Organ. Organ dedication plaque. This organ, rebuilt in 1919, is dedicated to the souls of this parish lost in the Great War. Oh. I see. Oh, here we go. A ghostly figure. Near this spot, the original St. Benedict's Rectory was lost to flames in 1901. A ghost of a new ghost image of a lady there. Woo! I love that. That makes life easy. There's one promise I never regretted. Oh, we got married in this church. Best day of my life. We had known from the start we would end up here sooner or later. Aw. Can I do something? Does it? It's a glow here. Can I do something with that glow? No, probably not. What's this lady doing? Ronan's fedora. We watched an old black and white gangster movie marathon the other night before last. I couldn't believe he had never seen them. I loved the romantic parts. He loved the tough guy parts. When I brought him the fedora the next day, he looked confused, but adopted it so quickly. It's just part of him now. I don't think he'll ever take it off. Yeah. Alright, so... Silence from the dark trials to come. Deliver us from the shadow of the evil one. Save us from the dark trials to come. If there's someone up there, please start protecting us. God. I hope this is helping. <sighs> She's praying what I'm thinking. It's getting dangerous out there with all these murders. At least we're safe in here. I don't think that evil bastard's gonna hide out anywhere near the church. Oh, well, there's a guy over there. A lot of prayers going up right now. Not just hers. But I'm sure it's just isolated victims he picks off. Mm. A lot of prayers going up right now. Not just hers. He wouldn't come in here, would he? Would he? Oh, at least I'm not alone. Uh, one of those demonic portals. What's these? Can't stop loving him. The man is who he is. I can't I can't help myself. I try to stay away to be sensible, to consider someone I could actually share a normal life with. But I find myself thinking of Ronan all the time, and I can't stop. Can't this is it. This is what real love is. Well, it sounds like they loved each other quite a lot. Why oh, is there a crow here? That's interesting. Alright. And there it is. Where is she? 
Wasn't there a clue about the church and the apartment? A clue about the church and the apartment. The photo? Church is always here now. I think we have an old attic you can stay in for as long as you like. Ah. Staying in the attic? I better go check it out. Church attic. The priest told us she could stay in the attic. Where would that be? Hmm. Where are most attics there, number one detective? The Bell Tower Banshee. Which is okay. Two of eleven. Okay, gotcha. Well, not this way. Eight more. Makes sense that there'd be multiple demonic portals in a church. Oh, hey, that's the father. This is my way across, at least. I'm going until I'm not over the portal. Okay. Almost. And now. Whew. The attic must be up there. <gasps> Kitty. There's the cat. Is this the girl going upstairs? It is. Going up. Potentially. Alright, let's. There's another mark. <gasps> I possessed a kitty! The cat. You can use Waza and hold left. Shift to run while possessing the cat. Some ledges can be jumped onto by running up to them. Okay, I'm gonna. That's awesome. I'm gonna do that in a minute. I wanna continue looking around here first. 10 out of 10, the whole game I can play as a kitty. Alright, let's see. Aha! Six more. more. Nothing else in this room, huh? Okay. That's an exterior. If I possess the cat and move as the cat, will the cat stay where I move to? Some people. I don't know, Angie. Brian is a lovely boy, but I don't know about his family. His mother does seem to be a bit of a heartbeat, but Brian's worth it. Yeah, I think so too, dear. It's just that Shelley didn't grow up around boisterous people, and I worry about the pressures of their relationship. Oh, Sheila, they'll be fine. You know they'll have a long, happy life together. Oh, I'm sure you're right. You've been her best friend since, what, fourth grade? 
<laughs> I think in some ways you know her better than I do. Yes, She's it had a is amazing, isn't it, Brittany? Motherhood, I must say, when she has kids, they're just gonna blossom with her. You're so sweet. I must admit I am looking forward to grandchildren. Has she said anything to you? Well, she hasn't said anything specifically. I know they both want kids, but they ought to have a couple of years just to enjoy each other. Of course, I don't, I don't mean to be selfish. I mean, what's the hurry? They're young. And I'm not, because I'm an old lady. It's so simple to be a nice person. Why can't everyone do it? My girl's marrying her love. That's all that counts. Do you think she's just going to repeat the first one again? It's so simple to yep. be a nice person. Why can't everyone she could do it? Override her back out of them. I hope my wedding isn't this stressful. He's a great guy, but she's right about his mother. I hope my wedding isn't this stressful. Ugh. All right. Let's see. There's that. Oh. Oh yeah, look at the three kids in the end of the hallway. That's not creepy or nothing. There's a couple of marks there. Well, I don't think there's any marks in here. So, where are you trying to lead me to, marks? Yeah, I well, not this way at least. Okay, so. I want to possess this guy. This would never happen in my kitchen. What would never happen in your kitchen? You want excellent food under these conditions? <gasps> this would never happen in my kitchen. Okay. Gordon Ramsay. Those events okay? Oh, yes, sir. Just regular maintenance. These things are big enough for small animals to go hiking in. Huh. So we just have to make sure none of the little critters get trapped in there. Well, what happens then? You probably don't want to hear about it in the food preparation area. It can get smelly. Maybe that's why they use incense, huh? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah, they're quite the fairy tale. They weren't high school sweethearts, you know. Everyone thinks they were, but they just seem like they've been in love forever. But they met right after college. Total chance thing, trip to Europe. I was hoping he'd meet a nice Irish girl in Dublin, but he met Shelley down in Florence. And she's from Boston. He travels thousands of miles across the freaking ocean to meet the love of his life, who lives right down the road. Kind of makes you believe in fate. Like they were just meant to meet and be happy together forever. Right? That's great. Really. Great. Do you follow football? I, I don't just mean the pass. Oh, this poor maintenance man's like, just go away, dude. Oh, yeah, sure. Sometimes. Now, my boy quarterbacked for the witches all four years at Sale I Was on the varsity when he was a freshman. Well, congratulations on the wedding. Uh, and the football. <sighs> Not even listen. Yep. <laughs> just go away. Well, this guy shut up. Uh. But this guy would love to see my boy play football. Oh, yeah, sure. It's not my fault. My kid's great. Oh, yeah. One of those parents. Yeesh. Okay. Outer walls. Let's see here. Ugh. I want to go take care of this demon. Okay, I'm not trying to be picky, but seriously, now do you call this a centerpiece? I'm sorry, ma'am. The request form said it would be a Puritan themed display. It wasn't a lot more specific. <sighs> look at that. Just look at it. You call that Puritan. There's plastic in that. You think there was plastic anything when they landed on Plymouth Rock? <laughs> well, I didn't think it needed to be that precise. Yeah. 
Ah, all right. So now we can move around freely. You didn't any of this, did you? Hmm. Authentic Puritan is organic, rustic, yet tasteful. It says Salem. This whole wedding from says Salem. My family, it's a not my pride. husband's Irish family. Don't you have any pride? Uh -oh. <sighs> Where do they get their help? Just no respect for history anymore. Can't wait till this one is over. I think I just found the only real witch in Salem. <laughs> Can't wait till this one is over. Okay. So. Ugh. Goblins, demons. Doesn't know there's a clue. Aha. Ah, okay, I see where we are. Oh, okay. Well, let's go get the kitty and go on a cat adventure. Shoot, cat, get out of here. Yeah. Aha! Got it. How do I jump? <gasps> I can meow. How do I? Oh, cat time! I didn't want to unpossess the cat. That was silly of me. Q. Left click. How do I, how do I jump? That space bar, which my gaming experience tells me that's what it would be. Normally, did the game tell me how to jump as the cat and I missed it? Also, where did it tell me I could jump as the cat? Lovely. Well, this is a problem. I see the thing. I see a little arc. Just meow and dispossess. How do I get through here as a kitty? I do this. And the cat jumps on its own. Are you gonna Kitty? Kitty It's gotta be a way to jump. Hmm. No. Oh wait. run. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow, meow. I gotta learn how to jump. How do I jump? Okay, I got running down. We got running down Pat. Alright. I am going to cut to game options. Alright, here, let's see. Let's pause, reveal, remove, possess, hide. Oh, this cute. Interact. Conclude investigation. Clues, I guess, is hold to run. Movement. Hold to detect mode. Back, skip cinematics. Select to hold to teleport. Camera control and zoom. Now that doesn't tell me. No, that's the don't, don't nope. Ooh, how do we? Oh, 
Oh. Meow. How do I jump? Game. Okay, F is that mode. <gasps> oh, good. There's no jumping. Left click. You left click. <gasps> Can I be a little shit? Push your bottle of champagne off the table, lady. Ha! Going on cat adventures. Running through the vents as a kitty cat. Ugh. How do I get this out of the way, though? Hmm. Going on cat adventures. Oh. Hello, ladies. Purr, purr, pet me. No, she doesn't want to. Going on cat adventure. I can just do this forever. Just run around as a kitty. Mew, 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 mew. Okay, so we're up in that vent. What's outside? There's a guy over here. We're probably better off at home with the doors locked. What am I worried about? Nothing is gonna happen. I think the cat's just standing there like, oh, I guess I'll wait for that ghost to come back and re-inhabit me. What's that kid doing? Ugh. Any... Nah, I just want to make sure. I hear the portals that the demons come through. Do, 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 do. Oh, look, there's the father. Now he can't hear me, he's vacuuming. Aha! <gasps> I can climb up vines! That's awesome. Meow, 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 meow. I didn't miss anything, did I? Meow, 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 meow. I don't think I did. Alright. Meow, 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 meow. Ooh, branching. Uh -huh. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> see any more of them ghost saws though to collect for clues nope up this way kitty oh I see more vine travel meow 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 oh well, we're not getting back out that way Meow, 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 meow. I never want to leave cat mode. Meow, 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 meow. Okay, she came up the elevator here. Ooh, there's a mark on the elevator. Ne, 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 meow. Let me in. Oh, gotta leave cat mode. Worst part of the game ever.
All right, kitty. I'll leave you right here. There she is, finally. Why do I always lose my keys when I need to leave? How can I get through to her? Cat mode and purr. No? Nah. Alright, let's see here. I'm not seeing any obvious things right around here. Which is fine. What would make her think about the bell killer? Oh, hiding from him, maybe? So get the hell out! Hey! God damn it, if you ever possess me again, I'll... I'll you have no right to dump your unfinished business Hold on. on me. Now, I'm tracking down my killer, okay? Someone who was seconds away from attacking you about an hour ago, and if... Can see me and hear me. <gasps> she really is a psychic. Holy shit! You're a medium. I'd say she's a small, but yeah. <laughs> well, I ain't, ain't I the luckiest guy in the world. I just found the perfect little helper. What is it with you guys and my family? Helping the cops do their job is not some. Some privilege. It's a trap. I'm not your informant, your partner, or your friend. I don't owe you anything. You owe me. Dick. Yeah, yeah, I, I get it. You're tough, okay? But you're not tougher than him. You saw what he can do. He's coming after you, or someone close to you. Whoever he wants dead is lucky to still be alive. Now, I know what I'm doing. And you can help me stop him. All you have to do is answer some questions. Look, I'm sorry. What happened to you was horrible. And you, you saved my life. So, what do you want? Vroom. All right. First things first. Let me look. Fine. Don't talk. Just do what I care. Let me look at some more clues, would you? There we go. And what's back? Um. Oh, please don't be something horrible. Please don't be something horrible. All right, they're all gonna fade out of existence, anyways. What's under the rug? Demons. The fittest of spirits can fall prey to these dangers. Becoming a demon. All right. Ah. I just need. I need like one more saw. Wait. It's. Okay, that's my ghost ability. This is my life. The killer. Julia's thoughts. That's locked. Truth about Baxter. Profile memories. Ghost girl's message. Ghost stories. Okay, we're two away from the bell tower banshee going. Okay, gotcha. And we got... A kitty. Alright, alright, alright. We'll talk. I was murdered tracking that son of a bitch to your place. So why would he be looking for you? That freak was probably looking for my mom. Not me. I, I'm a nobody. Invisible. My mom and I tried very hard to keep it that way. Not everybody wants to be noticed, you know. Looking 
looking for your mom. What does that mean? She's like me, but she found a way to make a respectable living off of what we can do. Living that probably turned her into a target. Ah. Have you ever seen my killer before tonight? Do you have any idea who he is? You cops are so hard up on clues that you're actually asking people if they know who the killer is? Now I get why you need so much help. I'm not asking people. I'm asking the witness whose life I just saved. Yeah, Brant. Respectable living. Yeah, hey, you might know her. She was working the Bell Killer case with the cops as a contract psychic, a profiler. Sorry, kid. She didn't ring any bells. I found this in the apartment tonight. Mentioned something about some Bell Killer book. And it's in her handwriting. Bell Killer book. If she was a profiler, it's probably the book she kept all her case notes in. That would be at the station. Really? So where's your mom, kid? Probably... dead. She would never just leave me without saying a word. Never. Oof. I don't know where she is. I know the bell killer had something to do with her disappearance. Him showing up tonight just proves it. If he killed her, why would he come back to her place? I don't know. Look, assuming the worst never helped no one. I'm telling you, I'm out of here soon. All right, all right. What were you doing at your apartment? I live there, Sherlock. Well, I used to, whatever. My mother has been missing for a few days. I don't see her that often, but she never just disappears. Not like this. I'm telling you, I'm out of here soon. Why don't you live there? Because of people like you, always asking for help. Trying to connect one last time with your loved ones or, or resolve some crazy problem. I love my mom, but I can't live in one place for too long or people like you will find me too easily. I wasn't home much either growing up. I know that's rough. You're not safe alone. You need someone watching over you. Us cops find missing people. I found you and I can help you find your mom. Your problem is now my problem too. No way. Uh, don't get me wrong, you saved my life and... Okay, I can't pay that back, but your problems are your problems and mine are mine. There they are. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Have a nice afterlife. Well, wait a minute. Don't go yet. Just stop for a second, will you? We're on the same side. If your mother's involved, we need to work together. Work together? What are you gonna do? You're dead. I'll handle it. Just leave me alone. Oh. Okay. Jeez. I bet she knows more. I can't let her get away. There's gotta be another way down. Track down the witness. I can't lose track of the witness. She's the only one who can help me find the bell killer. Yeah. <laughs> Meow. I think it might be kitty time again. But first. Okay. Yeah, I get it, game. The cat's meowing because I'm supposed to possess it. I'm not stupid. Just looking around real quick before I go. Hey, kitty. Meow. Yeah, let's go. I do 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 do. All right. Up. 
Let's get me. This got me so far. Nope. Aha, window. We can go through the window. Let's see now. Real. Here, we're out of the attic. That's a good start. The problem is, is I need the cats. I need to ride through the bad places, the kitty, but I don't see how to do that. No, it actually won't let me not space me. Here we go. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, 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 meow. I keep... Can you go up the ladder? No. Hmm. Meow. Well, I suppose I can not go as the cat. Let's see how far I can get without the kitty. Hey, kitty. Oh, here we go. Wait, come back. Leaving so soon, dear? Yeah, sorry. Uh, I'll be back. Don't wait up, Father. Be careful out there, Amateur. No, I... Oh, I need through that. Is this how I learned how to get rid of these? Probably not. A ghost can cause whole guys to manipulate people. Chase the witness. Into you. How much? This place is so cold tonight. Thanks, Father. When she calms down, I'll go ask her why she needs to stay here. Sounds good to me. See ya. <gasps> Distract. Some objects can be activated to distract demons. This draws the demon's attention and allows you to sneak past them unnoticed. Using the raven to distract the demon is often useful. Hide. Yeah, I know. I, I get it. I need to use distract. Execute the demon. You must approach the demon from behind if you want to execute it. Holding R will attempt an execution. Thanks for re-teaching me how to play a game. Oh! That didn't work! I didn't hold it down long enough. Oh, there's another one? You've got to be kidding me. Oh, that was the wrong one. She hit S instead of D. I'm not the smartest. Whew. Damn demons. Another 
facing each other. S and finish. Oh shit! Ah, uh, switched up the clicks on me. Go. Oh, good. She left the front door open for me. Wait, actually. Where's the last two of these saw blades? Now, I want to peek around for a second. There's got to be. I don't know if you guys can hear it. There's a bird outside mewing. Bird said mewing, I meant chirping. You know what I meant. Uh, okay, I may have to come back here later, I think, to finish this then. Okay. Let's not walk through that. Actually, no, I didn't walk through the pews. Let's do that real quick. Oh, hey. At least it's well lit. And there are people around. What guy got in his hand? A shoe? What was that? Thought I heard a sound. I can't smell good. If... It smells perfect. It smells like her. So you just decided to help yourself to her closet? No, 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 no. The ones in her closet were too new. Besides, she knew someone had been in there. I waited until she threw them out. You know, I was always good at waiting and watching. Sometimes she would look around like she could feel me watching. And if she caught you, then what? Your whole world would come crashing down. Why? It never has in the past. I deal with her the way I dealt with the others. And then I move on to the next one. Moving on in this place might be harder than you think. Hey, find your own girl. This one's mine. Yeah, it's not freaking creepy at all. What's with all the cloud now? I'm going to be able to interact with some of these things later. The patches of the past. Alright. Oh, there's another crow. Distraction crow. Ka. Well, if we come back, we come back. If we don't, we don't. Hey, 
kidding? So, where'd she go, huh? What clue would tell me where she's headed? Uh, run away, kill his identity, kill his motive, mother, church attic, mother missing, powerful scream. Mother missing? No. Mother's note. Leave now. Find my book at the station and don't look back. Mm hmm. Yeah. She's headed to the police station to steal some book. She'll blend in well there. Do you know her mother worked for the police? Fine. Don't tell me. Puss. to the station. So, do you think I just have one eternal ghost cigarette or do I have multiples? The witness is headed to the police station. Track down her mother's book. All right, and then we've got powerful scream. The witness's powerful scream disoriented me. How is that possible? She's a medium. The witness ran away from home to make it difficult for her needy ghost to find her. The witness's mother has been missing for a few days and she has no idea where to find her mom. Her mother's note implied the witness should get should get her bell killer case book from the station. Leave now. Find my book at the station and don't look back. We're not safe anymore. I'll try and find you before I go, mom. Killer's identity. The witness didn't know the killer. Who do I know that would want me dead? And the bell killer is probably looking for the witness's mother. Why would she be a target? She knows something. She probably figured out who he is. Okay. Go to the police station. All right. Let's go to the police station. On the way, I can look again on the beach for some... Gotta be one of these. There's gotta be one of these clues around here somewhere. Can't tell me they're all just. Let's see. Over here. Ghost boat. No, oh, I can go into the water a little ways. <gasps> Crab, you're pushing episode 100 to next week. Oh, no. Was it recording stuff didn't get done, or is it just editing stuff not going to get done in time? I found that first one. <laughs> Editing, it was a four hour recording session. Oh, geez, crap, yeah, okay. Oh, I can remove this. Aha! Oh, would you look at that? It's probably going to be a two or three parter. Oh, well, that's going to be cool at least. Well, I know this doesn't help anyone else besides me personally, but I, uh, I just listened to last week's episode today, so it won't be as long of a wait for me to the next one. <laughs> okay, I 
I've removed that. Can I remove any other things now? That's the question. Can I okay, hide? Yeah, great hide. The other thing I think it was maybe over here. Some of this goes. It's kind of shimmering. Oops, any other shimmers? Any of the shimmers? No. No. Crab, you saw that you liked all the Instagram posts. A little look down and had like eight numbers. Yeah. The only time I look at Instagram is when uh, I get the email from Instagram saying, hey, there's stuff going on on Instagram. It's like, oh, okay, I'll take a minute to go through and see what I've missed since the last time. Maybe the other gas canisters are in the alley. Now that I know that I'm looking for them. Let's see if we can find them in the alleyway. Whoop! Do, 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 do. Oh, hey. Got me to the other side of the thing. Aha! Family photo. She had so much potential. This is a terrible shock, especially now. She had been accepted to Smith College as it was all prepped for the move. It's a what now? It's a where now? It's a why now? I read all these. Yes. The whole story. Okay. The flowers and the inventory. All right, there. No, whoops. <laughs> Too many escapes. Crop, so what are my first impressions of so far of this game? I am liking it quite a bit, actually. I rather enjoy it. Although I do like these kind of... It's kind of a nice change of pace, because especially, especially since I just started Doom last Monday. This is a little more slower. It's more collect the clues, put the mystery together, not so much action-y. And then tomorrow I can go kill crazy, mowing down demons and demonic creatures in doom so it's a nice change of pace i like these kind of puzzly games every now and again just to break it up because let's be honest there are a ton of bang bang shoot 'em up games out there in the world and little niche -er type niche -er, little niche type games like this one kind of tend to uh, yeah did i play yes i did play la noir i've actually played la noir several times i loved that game i was so sad that there was never going to be a sequel because it got the studio got closed down right after the game got released. Just a dead end empty corner? What? Oh, here we go. So let's see, there has to be something here. Some questions cannot Some questions cannot be avoided. avoided. Wait. I didn't shit, I didn't collect the thing over here. I revealed it, but I don't think I collected it. <laughs> Oh, okay. So this is Ghost Girl's message. Interesting. Yes, Crab, they did... Um, it's not full VR support. What they did is they created... They created basically a, sl a slice of the game. So you can play... Uh, portions of it, certain cases in VR, but it's not the full game from what I understand, which I mean, is still cool. I mean, especially considering the fact that the game is how old and porting the whole thing over into VR capability would be a big task. Um, I remember when they first announced it, I kind of speculated that maybe they did it to see how much interest there would be in any more LA Noir sequels or other games so they kind of did it as a litmus test yeah yeah financially that would be a big order to try and swap it all over 
I don't seem to be able to get through this way. Nope. Okay. Hmm. I found things. I just haven't found any of those gas cans. I wonder if maybe because there's so many of them, they're spread out across the city more. It's hard to believe a cop got killed tonight. Cool. So quiet. Such a sleepy town. Sleepy sleeps. Lord, nothing happens here. Oh, except for cops getting killed. It's so nice to be away from the big city with all its problems. Yeah, I bet. How much does a tattoo hurt? Cop was like covered. What's that game? The one with the woman who raids tombs. <laughs> What's that game? The one with the woman that raids tombs. Hmm, what could it be? How much does a tattoo hurt? Cop was like covered. That's funny. <laughs> That's really funny. This is a Square Enix game too, so or it was published by them anyways. That's kind of a cute little nod to the Tomb Raider franchise. I did this. I talked him into this. Becoming a cop. I was lying dead in the street because of me. Sure why this memory is here. Okay, the place where it's that way, so let's go exploring in the opposite direction for a bit. What the What did I run into there just now? Can I remove this? No, no. And it wouldn't be sailing without some gallows. All right. Let's go over this way. Happy hour of day, five to six, two dollar pictures. Oh, there you go. I see exactly what I mean. Why is that so hard to understand? If she doesn't want to be in a relationship, she should be direct about it. Can I possess her now? I don't think so. What if he's never caught? Oh. Does he just keep going? Don't even think it's the same guy. Copycats. All of them. That's naive. But okay. cameras like in England what about them love how everything's walkable in this town what about those cameras like in England where are we going lady this is cool I don't even have to do anything she just walks around for me are we gonna circuit hmm. what's this all about I want to find more of those historical plaques. Said nobody ever. <gasps> Just have this feeling like something's watching. You know, just some ghosts. Love how everything's walkable in this town. Wait, what? What about those cameras? Like in England? Hey, I already heard those lines. <laughs> Is your twin walking around here? Ashland Hill Cemetery is founded in 1632 as part of the churchyard for the recent Puritan settlers of the Massachusetts Bay Colony. Certain traumatic events expanded the cemetery significantly, one of which gave the cemetery its name. In 1665, a shipload of immigrants escaping the plague in London realized that the ship's population was already infected. They remained quarantined in the area of the cemetery, waiting to die. When they did, their bodies were burned and their ashes buried, and the graveyard was henceforth known as Ashland Hills. Ooh. That's some real-world knowledge going. All right. I can't believe this. 
Are you happy now, asshole? Is this what you wanted? <laughs> you said I was the one. More like one of many. I don't even know what he sees in her. Oh, look at him. What a pig. He doesn't even feel guilty about what he did. Just look at him staring at her. Okay. You okay? Well, Frank up. He betrayed me. He said he'd love me forever, but he's marrying someone else. Did he cheat on me with her? I always thought there was someone else. Was it her? Does it matter? It looks like he's moved on. Maybe you should too. I can't. Not until I know the truth. Please, I must know. For better or worse. Alright. I'll look into it. <laughs> oh man. Doesn't take a detective it doesn't take a detective to see that this woman that the woman is heartbroken. I should try to figure out if her ex-boyfriend cheated on her. Man, I'm taking like every single little case in the book, aren't I? I still don't know why she killed herself. Everything seemed great. I guess that's why I'm so nervous with Susanna. The thing is, if she hadn't jumped off that cliff, I never would have found my real soulmate. Man, it's so messed up. Hmm. Looks like he wow. met this girl after his ex died. Oops. friend she never anticipated this a shoulder to cry on looks like the new girl only approached him because he looked so distraught and lonely well at least it's her answer oh come on okay fine I'm an idiot There we go. It seems this was all a big misunderstanding. I'm not sure how she'll take it, but I guess I'll find out. Right? Let's see. Oops. And bad news, just so we can clear those. I've escaped too many times. Hey. Good news is he wasn't cheating on you. The bad news is your suicide brought them together. So... So he really loved me? Looks like it. I've made a big mistake. He still thinks about you. Maybe you can take comfort in knowing that you'll never be forgotten. I suppose. I just wish I had trusted him more. Maybe it could have been us getting engaged. What's done is done, I guess. Anyways. Thanks for everything. Okay. Some really weird shit keeps people here from going to the afterlife. Okay. Private cemetery. Gotcha. Not that, that, that would stop. Wait, not that, that would stop. Oh. Not I can go on that way. Okay. That's the you can't go this way wall. Gotcha. 
Hmm. Hey. Hey, buddy. You on the clock or something? I was. I uh, worked here ten years until I couldn't take it anymore and ate a gun. Some secrets are just too heavy to carry. What exactly did you do? Some landscaping? Mostly grave digging. Pretty much everything you'd expect a groundskeeper to do. You know that's not what I meant. Look, you were once a detective, and I was once a... a humble groundskeeper. Let's just leave it at that. Fine by me, I was just trying to help. I said, let's leave it at that. Fine, jeez. Also, kind of looks like the guy that was creeping on the girl in the closet. I want to find more of those historical blacks. Said nobody ever. Okay, I'm getting repeats of the mines. I just have this feeling like something's <clears throat> watching. What if he's never caught? Does he just keep going? Don't even think it's the same guy. Oh. Copycats. That's boring. All of them. I get they don't want to make too many. K. Douglas family photo. She would never kill herself. She was happy with her life. Had plenty of friends. Someone must have done this to her. They must have. Hmm. <clears throat> okay. There's something back here. Oh, there is. How do I get through there, though? <sighs> BRB kitty. I gotta take a quick peek over here. There I go, thinking that fence was gonna stop me from getting through to the cat, and then I just whoop right through it. <laughs> Okay, so that's how I can get up there is the cat. What's over here? Okay, this is the other side of the we went down the street over there. I got it. That lady is walking around. Let's go see what this is. Article two. Salem police have still not made an official connection among the recent violent deaths. Community separate speculation is increasing that this is the work of a single killer. In the absence of other connecting clues, the consistent thread is the strange bell-shaped symbol found on many of the <clears throat> many of these crime scenes. No one has even the remotest theory on the meaning of the symbol, but this bell killer may have a personal reason for leaving this insignia. Hard-hitting reporting, that is. A bunch of hiding spots. I don't know if I like that. Ronan's childhood. <clears throat> Ronan's parents... Ronan's parents really sound unstable. It must have been really difficult for him growing up and feeling pressure to follow the unstable criminal path his parents walked. And now he's a diamond in the rough, such a sweet soul, and a strong enough to keep its sweetness with everything his parents put him through. It's rare someone with a legitimate reason to be frustrated with his parents and the way he, they raised him ever once complained about it. He's such a better person than anyone realizes. At least she saw the good side of him. Some little symbols. We got a gas can over here. Thirteen more to go. Yeah, that's got to be a whole game map or city map wide collection of those. And I'm back here where we were just a minute ago. Cool. All right, let me pick up this secret. K. Douglas, cause of death. Victim was hanging from ceiling fan. Possible suicide, but no note. Bell symbol raises possibility of murder. Interesting. Alright, kitty. Let's go on some more cat adventures. Cat adventure time. Boop, 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 boop. I'm gonna go on a kitty cat adventure. A do, 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 do. Right. I can go that way. What end? Ah, to this end. 
That's not open. Aha! Good kitty. <laughs> yeah. Aha. Climb up this truck cloth. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nee, nee. What do you know? All right. Where did I want to go? Aw. I can't get out of here. But I want to go over there. Look at the st Okay, sorry, camera, I'm fighting with you here. I want to go over there and look at the stuff. Let's see. Where does this go? Meow, 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 meow. No, can't, can't scoot through there. Climb vines? No. All right, I have a theory. I have an idea. Meow, meow, meow. <coughs> Oops. Now, okay, just jumps down. Mm, let's see. Ah, no, can't jump the fence. They thought of that. They thought about it. Wait, is that it? Oh, no, it's not open. Can't jump through the plastic. Well. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Yep. Can't get on the car. Boo. Oh, look, there's a ghost up there. Huh. Creepy. Alright, kitty. Thanks for the trip. <clears throat> so how do I get through the hole in the wall here? Hmm. Let's go over here. Oh, let's go over here. It's hard to believe a cop got killed tonight. Let me guess. She's just gonna say something about. What's that game? The one with the woman who raids tombs. Yep. Same old, same old. Nothing new. The day we met. I still remember the first time I laid eyes on that man. Ronan had all that bad boy swagger, and I admit I liked it. But what I liked even more was the heart underneath the facade that he couldn't hide. He was a guy from a rough neighborhood, but it couldn't harden him as much as he let on. Hmm. Alright, what are these? Rexus Sense and Guild. Okay. And then we have whatever this last one is. Ghost check. Everything in the shadows makes me jump. What? What was that? Nothing. Everything in the shadows makes me jump. Okay. You're not taking me anywhere helpful. All right. Let's see. Well, we didn't 
poke our nose down this one just yet. That looks weird. The car. Identify more of those historical plaques. Said nobody ever. Uh. What if he's never caught? Does he just keep going? Maybe. Okay. <gasps> just have this feeling like something's watching. Go back through that wall you just came through, dude. Need you to get me to the other side of that wreckage. <laughs> they just went. Oh, come on! Damn it, game. <clears throat> Can't possess my way through the ghost stuff. Okay, so. <laughs> get in here. But can't get out of here is the cat. <clears throat> Though. Going through here, it's the cat would get me through this hole in this. Anyways, there's a way to get to it. Just not sure what it is at this point. Because <clears throat> there isn't one of these on the other side either. It's not like I just zip through. Hmm. Oh well. I suppose for now that's enough wandering around the city. Head towards the police station. I don't know what constitutes a checkpoint in this game either, so I want to get to the police department before I stop. <clears throat> Since we've hit the. Oh, actually, we're 10 minutes past the three hour mark, so yeah. <clears throat> Can I go down this one? Oh, yeah, yeah, this is. Uh... Isn't this where I went initially when I followed the girl? Hello. Family photo. Hey, paper. You're uh, a little later than you said you were going to be, aren't you? We were nervous about the amount of candles and oil lamps Claire had in the house. She loved the dim light, especially in her s in her seances. She didn't take them seriously. She just wanted to talk to dead celebrities. Oh, boy. Yeah, okay. Well. Oh. Hello. Does this get me anything, though? No. no. Mm, got me in a dead end shack. Wonderful. Okay. Ugh. Well. It's one more thing, anyways. Can I move the... Yes. Perfect. Aha. <clears throat> Cause of death was burn shot. Kerosene from an oil lamp covered front of clothing, hands and face. Likely a large spill. Then ignited by a nearby flame. Oh, no. That'd be a horrible way to go. Here's another one of those. street brawls. <laughs> it's amazing I lived as long as I did. Oh, don't. Don't feel bad about it, Paper. It's fine. Uh, I was crazy how often someone picked a fight with me from early on trying to put me in a place at for in my place at first, then trying to prove something with their failed attempts to beat me down. Did anyone ever tell them you never poke the sleeping bear? Uh, true enough. True enough. Family of three. <clears throat> Family is what you're given, and also what you make it. I had such a lovely dinner with Rex and Rona, the two men in my life. 
What are the chances that these two guys are going to be the best of friends like brothers? They can really be themselves around each other, and I get to see a different side of each of them. I'm so grateful. Oh boy. <laughs> Alright, and there's this collectible right here. <clears throat> Victim died of massive blunt trauma when a bookshelf in her shop collapsed on top of her. Interesting. Oh, paper. You missed it earlier. Where did I hear that? I heard it. <gasps> paper, look. I'm a cat now. Cat, cat, cat time. Running around is cat time. Cat, cat, cat time. Aha! Look at me. Look at me. Meow. Meow, 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 meow. Huh? Huh? Do, 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 do. Huh. And I can climb vines. Because I'm super kitty. Huh. Yeah. Meow, 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 meow. <gasps> Ghost lady. What's up, ghost lady? Shh, paper. Goodness. What, what, what happened here? That looks like like a baby down there. Please help me. It's supposed to be dead. I can still feel growing inside me. It's trying to rip its way out. Wait. You did this? You, you killed your own kid? Oh. You don't understand. There was something wrong with it. <clears throat> it wasn't human. It, it was something else. Something darker. What the hell are you talking about? It showed me things. Horrible things. This was the only way to stop them from happening. But I was too late. They've already begun. I, I can see them crawling their way up from the flames. We have to run! can't run from this. If you want it to stop, you have to find a way to, to move on. I, I can't. There's nowhere to go. There's only darkness and flame. Okay, crazy lady. Ah, uh, thanks, paper. Now, let's... Oh, God. There's a baby down there. There's no escaping this hell. Oh, lady. <clears throat> hey, kitty. Can we go this way? Guess not. Oh, I can't even... Right. Thanks, kitty. Excuse me, lady. Oh, what does it matter? Whoa! God. That's dark. Yeah, it's real dark. Okay, that's a dead end. Alright, right, we're going to the police station so I can hit a for certain checkpoint for a stop. Right, right. Stay on task, me. Let's see. What's in here? A lot of nada. Too bad. Also, I realize this is taking me the wrong direction, but... I haven't been here since the ghost girl first told me about being a ghost, so I want to... Double check that I didn't leave anything. Aha, see? Publicity photo of a victim, and my inner tribute was held a few days later by her customers and friends. Oh, the one that had the shelf dropped on her head? I don't think there's anything in there clue-wise. Do, 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 do. And we're just back here. Fair enough. Let's see. Can't go through there. Can go through here. Kids. This is where I was with the cat. Okay, gotcha. Cool. Let's. 
warm. And then out here through the barrels. And then turn this way. Back out into the street. Hey, this door is open. Can I go through it? Oh, that's the apartments. Oh, this is where I died. Right, this is where I died. Oh, there's not even a chalk outline on me? Come on. All right. <clears throat> hey, you. What are you thinking? How much does a tattoo hurt? Cobb was, like, covered. That's yeah, thrilling. I've heard that three or four times now. Ooh, is there anything here? Nope. And clue. Uh, Ronan pops the question. Today he asked, and I honestly didn't know what to say. I want to be with him, I love him, but when he asked me to marry me, I found myself unable to say anything, like my voice was frozen, and he just knelt there, my silence crushing him, and then he got up. It was five minutes before I could tell him I needed to think, but have I blown it now? I mean, if the guy really loves you, no. Wait, 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 wait. hold on a second. 52 out of 173 things to collect? Holy smokes. All right. Uh, there used to be something here. Did I? Okay. Uh, if I possess you later, you're going to say something interesting. It's going to be the same old crap I've heard 12 times already. Would a new police chief do better? That was actually new. I should go home. Now. Yeah, you probably should, instead of sitting here in the dark in the middle of the night. Like a weirdo. Have I been over here? No. Hi, kitty. What adventure shall we go on today, kitty? Meow, 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 meow. Look for jump points. Oh, I think I see it. Meow. 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 Here we go. Ram. I do, 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 do. Ram. Ram. Hey. Kitty. There you go. Up the vines. Over here. Onto the air conditioner. Onto the rail. Up to get this. Oh, I don't have to reveal them. I just collect them. Well, that's good to know. <clears throat> and. Hi, kitty. Enjoy your nap on the fire escape. Wait, why can't I get Whoa, what happened? Oh, I hit space bar, that's what happened. Game. I'm supposed to be able to walk through these things. Kitty? Is there somewhere else we can go? Oh there we go. Back down to the alley. Alright, kitty, I'll leave you back here where you're having your little nap. How's that? Alright. And okay, nothing behind the fence. It's kind of weird that fence is there, to be honest. If there's just a dead end, but maybe it's for a reason. Okay, so oh gosh, more collectibles. Here's one. I know I just said I didn't need to do that, but I just went with what the prompt said to do. <laughs> Hiding spots, plenty over here. Yeah, what's this? Judgment House plaque. Oh, I see. Known as Judgment House, the former residence of Judge John Hathorne, 1641 to 1717, who at times held court in his own parlor room, he kept the accused locked in his cellar, as was the custom in colonial times. 
His unfortunate role in the witch trials of 1692 became a permanent blotch on his name. Ugh, that one does. Yeah, you want to. Not going that way. Not going that way. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be associated with witch trials either. What's this? Salem feels dangerous. Salem is supposed to be a quiet place. The kind of place where you can escape the problems of the big city. But it's getting to where I don't feel safe walking outside at night here anymore. I talked with Ronan about it, and he tries to assure me that he's the most dangerous guy in this town. But the bravado doesn't help much. Something is sick about this place. Yeah, probably has something to do with, you know... The dozens, if not hundreds, of women that were put to death for being witches. Probably, you know, messed shit up. Ugh, those are so creepy. Seven to go. We're getting there. <clears throat> Still don't know how I'm going to get that one on the side of that wall. Stay in well lit places. Should be okay. Hmm, yeah, stay in well at places. That should work. Throw it out a window. That would be so awful. Uh, yeah, it wasn't fun, let me tell you. Where? Oh, there she is. Hey, lady. You anything interesting to tell me? Oh, too late. She went through the ghost wall. I can't follow her. Let's see here. Interesting where the old city and the new city are intersecting, making a little bit of a maze. Would a new police chief do better? Spain, pretty sure they burned them. Oh. Real witches didn't have those hats. In Spain, pretty sure they burned them. Well, I shouldn't be surprised, it's the same character model. So C. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, hey. This guy's a ghost. I should talk to him. Oh, God. Hey, hey, hey. <coughs> Calm down for a second and talk to me. What's your name? Uh, oh, uh... Brad. Good. Now, tell me what happened. I don't know. We were out of the town blowing off some steam. One drink turned into three, and three turned into... Who knows how many? <clears throat> the details are hazy. I, uh, I must have been driving Rick and Laura home when... Oh, God. I killed them. I'll never forgive myself for doing this. You don't know if you did. You said it yourself. The details are hazy. Now, I can take a look around here and see if anything jumps out at me. God... What have I done? Here's some car crash. It's not much to go on, but this brutal car crash might have some evidence that points to what happened that night. It might. Uh, be rad. Hmm. This must be Brad's car. It's not looking good. The car's vanity plate. There's no doubt this is Brad's car. It's true. What's this? Yeah, booze. Scotch whiskey. A broken bottle of Brad's favorite whiskey. Not a good sign. Oh boy. And then this. Huh. Gas station receipt. It's not much, but it's something. Gas station's not far from here. I should check it out. An SLC gas receipt from the night of the accident. It's a long shot, but I should check the area. Oh, you want me to go to the gas station now? Alright, well... I'm going to collect these two. Boop. And the one over here. This plaque. Boop. 
On this spot stood a fortification that contained the armament stored sought by British soldiers on February 26, 1775. The brave citizens of this town kept the British army at bay by the strategic use of drawbridges, thereby preventing the seizure of critical weapons for the war that would begin only months later. Nice, good job, team. Okay, can I move any of this junk? No. Okay, well... Oh, I'm getting myself all sorts of sidetracked, but I do want to... Where is this gas station? I don't remember passing it. It must be up ahead further. Let me go peek around this corner. I think what I'm going to do is just stop. Oh, there's the gas station. Why did I go around that hedge? I didn't need to go around that hedge. Here we go. Refueling. I didn't know you were such a lightweight. <gasps> wow. So weird. Somebody was alive, and now they're not. If cops aren't safe, who is safe? Nobody. Yeah, I'm sure that'll do it. If I ever met the killer in the street, I don't know what I'd do. Plus and regular. A vomiting man. You. Oh, there's a train track used to run through here. What's Brad doing? Cap. Cap. <laughs> I mean, cap. What? Oh. Uh. Gas station. Yeah. The SOC. Okay. Great. What are you doing? Okay. A couple more clues. Gas station is back. SOC is commonly believed to stand for Salem Oil Company. However, no such company exists. The initials actually stand for Sons of Charlie. The legal name of the service station established by three brothers, Chuck, Charles Jr., Sean, and Seamus O'Leary in 1928. When automobiles started to become common, the business nearly did not survive the Great Depression, but managed to keep itself alive as a front for illegal alcohol sales during Prohibition. And do what you gotta do, right? I see this thing back there, so I don't know how to get to it just yet. And I can see this just continuing to carry me on for another hour if I don't stop. So, I am going to just stop. Ooh, I know none of these people are going to say anything interesting, but I still am tempted to possess them to see if they do. I thought I saw something over here. Oh, there it is. The plaque. Fountain dedicated to This fountain is dedicated to the hope that this quiet town of Salem will be known for peace and reverie. Yeah. Wishes and fishes, am I right? Alright. So, there's another secret hidden something. something. Wow, there's a train tra crash here. Wow. Don't worry. Do you know how we're getting past it yet? So... Um. Is there a witness who saw who was driving? Me? Me? Uh, anyways. 
I'm just gonna hope that picking up that last collectible and doing this hit checkpointy and we can just stop. I don't suppose it would show you know what? Let's see what happens. Let's see how far back it puts me. Cause at least I'll know. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Oh no. Oh, yep. So... Alright, so well we know for next time. Oh that That sucks. That sucks so much. Yep. Okay. So gotta hit that checkpoint. Gotta hit that checkpoint. I already revealed this though. Oh I see. I have to re-reveal things that I've already seen. I don't know. I don't know. Well, no point. Okay. Perfect. Just absolutely perfect. This is like the last half hour, 45 minutes worth of stuff wiped out just now. Oh well. At least I found out now instead of finding out next week when I went to start up on... Oh well. Thank you all. Shut up, Cricket. Thank you everyone that showed up. I appreciate you being here. Thanks again to Lunatic Chef for those 2,500 bits earlier. It was very much appreciated. And yeah, I'll be back tomorrow evening at 5 p.m. PST to play some more Doom Eternal. We'll continue fighting our way through the hordes of Demon Spawn and the Minions of Hell. And then I'll be back after that on Thursday, new day, at 5 p.m. PST, and we'll be continuing the Tales from the Borderlands playthrough on Thursday at 5 PST. So, I hope to see you either tomorrow, Thursday, both days, maybe not until next Sunday, whatever works for you. Otherwise, as always, wow, I just forgot my outro. I don't say it very often anymore. Um, actually, is there anyone I can raid? I don't do raiding often enough. Now, well, there's no channels that I follow that are... No channels I follow are streaming right now, so... I'll just call it eh, good. Paper, the new setup is bullshit. Why, Paper? You don't like the new hours? But, yes. Um, thank you again, everyone. Hope to see you next time. And, as always, please stay safe out there.